Hi guys, welcome back. Today is May Empties already, which is crazy. It's crazy that it's basically the middle of the year. We're getting... Wow, I, just, I can't believe it. Anyway, um, let's get into the empties this month. I know I didn't film last month's empties, but I will say that the total was around $35. Not that good. And this month, it's not that good either. So as a total, I think I'm close to 300 which by this month, I should be close to 500 So I am falling behind, but I still have empties, and I want to show you guys what my empties are. So let's start. And I'll just kind of grab them out of this short bag here. So the first one is this... Uh, moisturizing conditioner from Brainless. If you guys have seen my videos before, you know that I love this conditioner. I, you know, it's only three dollars, but for me, it does go by fast. Um, but I do like this, and it does help uh, your hair. Next one is this candle that I got from Dollar Tree. And yeah, look at that nice burn. <laughs> it's, it had two scents. It was like a coconut and then a pineapple. And this one's, it did smell really good. Like, just, oh, really nice. I don't know if I would repurchase it. Because I'm the only one in the family that likes coconut and pineapple scents. But it was nice to try out. Once again, another candle from Dollar Tree. And this is the birthday cake one. It smells like birthday cake. You know, it it smells... It smells like the cake batter <laughs> chapstick. Um, but that's what it looks like. And I did finish it up. Which I'm really happy about. And then another candle from Dollar Tree that I used up is this uh, Pure Tea Leaf Scented Candle. And you might be wondering, oh, that's still a lot of candle or wax you got in there. It's like, yeah, but like the wax line itself kind of got smothered in the candle. So, because I was trying to bring some of it down. But anyway... This smells like hot tamales or an apple cinnamon uh, scent. I mean, it just it smells so good. Um, but for a Dollar Tree find, it it was pretty good. Now these candles from Dollar Tree, yeah, they smell good, but I noticed that they don't really like. You can't really smell it in the room unless if you're like going right by it. So I don't know if I would get. Dollar Tree candles again, and I do have more that I'm working on to try to finish or uh, get them out, but I don't know. Next thing here is this feature length um, black mascara from Barry M Cosmetics. I got this from a friend on Instagram. That's what it looks like, and I'll show you what the wand looks like. Wand is just that, just a little baby. But I will admit, this is my favorite mascara I have ever tried. I think it's, it's the brush. I really think it's the brush that really, I, I love this mascara. I do, and I, oh. But I have other mascaras to get through. But, um, and I do want to try the new Flower Beauty, their, their purple mascara, but I can't remember the name of it. Like Lash Princess, I think. Something like that. Um, Princess Warrior. But oh my gosh, I love this mascara so much. It really helped lengthen and volumize my lashes. Highly recommend it. And that was $6.57 US dollars. Um, because when I went on their website, it was 
pounds, which is, and then you have to convert it to U.S. dollars, so, but I believe it's five pounds on the website. Alright, the next one here is the formula 10.0.6 Seaside Glow Skin Hydrating Peel Mask with LG and C Clay. This is just a sample size. I do have another one of these that I got. Um, I do like it. I do like peel masks. I just, I didn't like the smell. The smell kind of reminded me if you walked into an Amber Common Fitch or Aeropostale. You know, kind of that real, like, perfumey scent. Um, yeah, it's like just walking into Aeropostale or American Eagle or those places. So it's just, I have another one of these, and I might as well use it up. But, I mean, this the mask itself, it did work. It's just the smell I didn't really like. And that's kind of surprising because I like that brand's products because of their small. <laughs> um, the next one here is from Meme Box, and it's the I Do Care Cake My Day Hydrating Sprinkle Wash Off Mask. Once again, this is just a sample. Oh, and I forgot to mention that this is worth two dollars and six cents. Um, this I actually really did like. Um, so you'd put the product on your face in your face it, ha it can't be dry it has to be kind of you know damp and you leave it on there for five minutes and then you wash it off this smelled so good it smells like cake and then it looked like cake and I oh it's so good and it does help off wash you know, makeup that you want to wash off. So I really do like this. And this was, or is, um, where, where, where? I thought I had it on here. Oh, there it is. $2.49, and I think I got the reuses out of this. Next thing is this brow gel from Anastasia Beverly Hills, their clear brow gel. Just a sample one. This is the first time I've ever tried like a brow gel itself, and I love it. <laughs> I actually bought uh, a drugstore one to see, you know, is it really worth buying more of, and I think it is. Um, and this is what the brush looks like. Um, smell, it smells like, it smells like alcohol, which I don't know if that's good or bad or what, but it smells like, like beer, and it's just, <laughs> I mean, besides the smell, it actually did work and hold my eyebrows, because they are crazy. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I do recommend this to anybody who wants to try it. Um, but I would say if you are, like me, the first time trying it, either get a sample um, of the Anastasia or go to e.l.f. or any other drugstore that kind of has a cheaper option. And then if you do like that, then go on to the Anastasia one. But yeah, I like this so much. And if Anastasia wasn't... So expensive, I would get a full size of this. But for this, it is $6.68. So, I mean, yeah, you do get your money's worth out of it, but I think I'm good with the drugstore for now. Alright, um, two more products. So, the next one is these Calm and Focus Support Dietary Supplement Pills from Brandless. And it only comes with 14 but for $3, I mean, you can't, it's not that bad. I remember on Instagram, I posted the empty of it, and I said that it helps me focus and that stuff. 
and I stopped taking my ADD medication because of it, because it didn't make me feel sick and zombie-like, you know, like the ADD meds did. And I'm now seeing that I haven't really been taking it lately, and I don't notice a difference. Like... Even when I'm on, when I take that pill in the morning, I still act the same. I still, but to put it away, the pill doesn't help me. If the pill, my brain thinks that the pill is helping me, but it's not. Like my body's saying, no, it isn't helping you, but your brain's like, but my brain's like, yeah, it is. You're you're more fo you're more focused, and it's a focus pill. So co it's like, no, I I don't think so. <laughs> so I won't get that again. I do have one more bottle of it, or two, one or two. So once I do use those up, I'm not gonna get those again. Um, yeah, cause I just found out that no, they don't work for me. For me. I don't know about you guys, but if you do want to try it out, do try it out. But at least for me, it did not help me focus. Um, and even if it did, it was very little. It wasn't like my ADD medication did. Anyway, sorry to get off that rant. Um, once again, that was $3.00. The last empty is the Pacifica Stress Rehab Coconut and Caffeine Facial Mask. And this was a one-time use mask. I really did like this. It smells really good. It did hydrate my face. I don't know if it helped me with my stress, but it smelled really good. <laughs> and, um, yeah. And it is, and Pacifica is vegan and cruelty free, so that's good. And for this uh, one sheet, it is four dollars. So I mean, four dollars for one sheet, yeah, that's kind of spendy. But every once in a while, you need to treat yourself. So you know what? I think that's good. Um, but yeah, so those are all the empties. So the total of this month is thirty dollars and eighty cents. That is not even close to my $100 budget, or not budget, but goal. But hopefully with summer coming up, I'll use my makeup more and get more empties and use other products up. But as of right now, it's kind of just been a, a lull. <laughs> Um, anyway guys, that is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.